Here we have my heat pump hacking setup. So on the left we have the uh, Raspberry Pi in a case from RS. We have the IR toy from Dangerous Prototypes. We have a USB hub with the Wi-Fi card. And we have my phone. So let's go in here and add an event to my heat pump calendar. So there's a couple you can see already. Let's just set it to 20 degrees. So it's going to go from 3 to 4 p.m. So it's on the heat pump calendar. Yeah, good. So now the next time it it pulls the calendar, it should see that there's an event for 20 degrees and send it to the IR toy. So let's just stop and, and watch it. As you can see right now, the heat pump is off. So within a minute or so, it should should get this new signal and transmit it. So, in the meantime, why did I do this project? Well, I bought the heat pump and it works great except it's got a very simple remote control to it. You can't really set a, an advanced schedule. And the Nest and the Ecobee are also fantastic but they don't work with these sort of heat pumps since they don't have a thermostat you can rig up to them. So the only option was really to, to hack it with infrared or maybe get in there and, uh, and play with some wires. So I went for the infrared route since I'm not really an electronics guy. And yeah, the, the IR toy has been a, a great little, little unit. It's easily hackable. So I, I wrote a Python uh, module called PyIRToy, which is available on GitHub. And the project for this that stitches it all together is called HackPump, which is also available on GitHub. So shortly we should see the IR toy uh, transmit a signal to the heat pump. And we should also hear the heat pump. There it is. So it just got turned on. You can see the LEDs are on now. It's great. So when there's no event on the calendar, it'll just go back to turning off. So hopefully this is useful for other people trying to, uh, to hack their heat pumps. And actually it's good for more than just a heat pump. It's good for anything that uses uh, 38 kilohertz infrared signals. Okay, thank you.